Dear Dentist and Dental Students, Root Canal Obturation is the procedure in which the cleaned and shaped root canal system is filled three-dimensionally with an inert biocompatible obturation material. There are so many different techniques introduced which are very efficient in obturating the root canal system. Some of the techniques are very easy to perform but may not fill the root canal system three-dimensionally. At the same time, there are systems like vertical compaction technique which are technique sensitive and requires a steep learning curve which can fill the root canal system three-dimensionally. But it is extremely difficult to do vertical compaction in canals which are very narrow or have an acute curvature. The plugger used for compacting gutta percha should reach the apical one-third of the root canal for efficient obturation. But in narrow and curved root canals, this is difficult or sometimes impossible. The search for the system, which is easy to perform at the same time, which can provide three-dimensional obturation even in curved and narrow root canal systems, has led to the development of carrier-based obturation systems. In this presentation, I will explain about the procedure for performing carrier-based root canal obturation with simple graphics which will be definitely helpful for clinical practice and academics. I am Dr. Benin. If you are a dental student or a dentist, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel Smart Dentistry. I will make videos that will be useful for dental students and dental practitioners. Basically, the obturator which is used for carrier-based obturation technique consists of a central core in which gutta percha is coated. The central core was made of metal in older systems. Later, taking into the considerations of difficulties posed by this metal core during retreatment and post-placement, the newer systems consist of a plastic core which can be easily removed during post-space preparation or retreatment. Even to simplify this, the recently introduced gutta core obturation system consists of a central core which is made of cross-linked gutta percha, thus enabling easy retrieval during retreatment or post-space preparation. All the obturators of different brands consist of a stopper which can be adjusted according to the working length. As master cone verification cannot be performed when carrier-based obturators are used, the rubber stopper plays a major role in accurate root canal filling. These obturators are available in different sizes and tapers to correspond to the final file used for cleaning and shaping, that is the master apical file. The technique of carrier-based obturation can be subdivided into the following. Selection and verification of size verifier, selection and preparation of carrier-based obturator, placement of the carrier-based obturator, removal of the excess and core of the carrier-based obturator. Let's see all these steps one by one. As mentioned already, it is not possible to take a radiograph with the carrier-based obturator in place. Some system recommends the use of a special instrument called as size verifier for accurate selection of the obturator. Size verifier has a non-cutting tip and corresponds to the size of the master apical file. The size verifier is placed inside the root canal at the predetermined working length and the fit is verified. If needed, a radiograph may be taken to check the extension and position of the size verifier inside the root canal. Once the correct size verifier is selected, the same size obturator is selected. For example, if the size verifier selected is of tip size 20 and taper 6 percentage, same size obturator is chosen. The selected obturator has to be prepared for obturation by placing it in an oven. 
carrier based obturators come with an oven which has a heating chamber. The selected obturator is placed inside the heating chamber for the manufacturer's recommended time. Usually it is around 15 seconds. By placing inside the oven, the gutta percha gets softened by the heat. Now the obturator is ready to be placed inside the root canal. This placement procedure has to be completed in less than 10 seconds because as time passes, the heat softened gutta percha will again get hardened which can result in incomplete seating of the obturator inside the root canal system. Before placement of the prepared obturator inside the root canals, the canal should be coated with a thin layer of root canal sealer, preferably with a paper point. The obturator is now placed inside the root canal with firm apically directed pressure till the rubber stopper reaches the predetermined position. Firm apical pressure must be applied while the gutta percha hardens. This procedure should be accomplished in less than 10 seconds. If the tooth to be obturated has multiple canals, then another obturator is prepared and placed in the remaining canals following the same principle. The modern heating ovens comes with dual heating chambers so that two obturators can be prepared at the same time. Once the gutta percha hardens, the handle can be tilted back and forth two or three times to separate the core and excess material at the orifice level if needed can be packed with the help of a root canal plugger. If the obturator has a metallic or a plastic carrier, then it can be cut with a low speed handpiece with the burrs provided along with the obturators by the manufacturer. With the cross-link gutta percha as the carrier as in gutta core system, the softened material can just be scooped with a sharp spoon excavator and the gutta percha at the orifice can be packed with a plugger. In the end, the permanent coronal seal is placed and now the obturation procedure is complete. Carrier based obturation technique is very easy to perform at the same time it provides the best quality obturation even in narrow and curved root canal system where other systems are impossible or very difficult to perform. Carrier based root canal obturation system can fill the lateral and accessory canals thus enhancing the success of root canal treatment. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.